hey guys what's going on so we are outside today and I bought a trailer that I'm sitting on right now we're gonna take a look at it here in a second um, when I bought this thing I originally wanted to turn it into a car trailer uh, once I got it home and started measuring it it's gonna be iffy for a car trailer it's um it's wide it's like 75 or so inches wide it's like 16 feet long uh, we're gonna take a look at it and see what we got here and I'm gonna tell you what we're gonna do with it to get it back ready to go on the road again okay guys so here's my trailer that I got and basically what it is is an old camper trailer it's 16 feet long and if you measure it from there across to there to the outside it's like 67 and a half but if we look here you can see the board overhangs and you've got enough room in between the tires up in there if I overhang this board by about three inches on each side it gives another six inches and that'll give us almost 75 inches of loading space on this trailer so that's probably what we'll do um, we'll probably put a wood deck on it although I have been thinking about putting a diamond plate deck on but we'll probably end up going with wood just because it's gonna be a lot cheaper than trying to buy the diamond plate the other things we're gonna do is what, what right made me mad about this trailer is it's got four new tires on it and four new wheels now the old wheels sit up there and when I went to pick this thing up the guy told me that the tire should hold air but when we got there put air in them you can see here you know they were peeling really bad and I had to drive it about 30 40 miles from where I live so I ended up biting the bullet and going to track supply and getting four tires and four wheels for it which I was going to do anyways but I wasn't planning on doing it yet or the plan on buying that till last so if we look down inside there it's, it's a dual axle trailer and I don't know if you can see it or not probably not the leaf springs there it's got four leaves on it two axles four springs and they're five lug so I'm pretty sure these are 3,500 pound axles if we're looking here this is a, a battery holder I'm gonna cut that out because I don't really need that for what I'm doing and um, these things here this thing here that um, right there that right there and they're on both sides all that's gonna get cut off also they're gonna cut off this thing here is gonna come off I'm gonna put a new trailer jack on it uh, this stuff here not exactly sure what that is but that's gonna come off of there what I want to do here in the center where this battery box is is cut this out and actually weld in some bracing and set uh, a trailer box inside there to put like straps and chains and binders and stuff like that now the first thing we're going to do is um, pull this thing off pull this stuff off here get all that cleaned up and then we're going to do the task of bringing a wire wheel and um, sanding all this stuff down getting all that rust peeled off there with a with a um, wire wheel or something on a brush and then we're going over the whole trailer and getting it, uh, as much rust cleaned off as we can once we do that we can put some primer on it and then go from there to weld our angles in and then put new decking on it the other thing about this trailer is the lug nuts these are the lug nuts where the, the they're not really lug nuts they're studs on the back side of these bolts so we're going to have to replace the, the um, wheel bearings and stuff on this so when we do that I'm probably going to put this and change these over to the stud type and put the stud type instead of these these are a bitch to put on is on these sides here where these are I might put some stake pockets weld like a stake pocket in there and a stake pocket in in here somewhere and then the same thing on the front and put two on each side of the wheels or either that or put some d-rings in I think that's gonna do it again don't forget to go into the comments below give me a comment tell me what you think there's links in the description below check them like comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thanks for watching and I will see you in another video.